Hey guys, today I'll be showing you how to make advanced pan and crop, or how I like to call it, advanced screen pumps. It's used mostly for velocity, but you can also use it uh, as a regular screen pumps. For example, in few last montages I used it as regular screen pumps, because it's actually much better. I'd say I prefer it. So let's get straight in the video. I'll be demonstrating how to use span and crop only and not velocity. If you want to learn how to use velocity, you can check out my velocity tutorial. It's gonna be on your screen right now. Okay, so if you're here, then let's get in the video. Um, first, click this thing here. I'll explain what it does later. Find the position um, line and just make a point anywhere in this line. That will enable this line uh, down here. And you go here and double click on it. Now you enabled your pen and crop line. Now you can make points right under the video by double clicking. Like this. Right? So, um, if you don't know what pen and crop is. Oh shit. Right, let me do this again. Okay, if you don't know what pen and crop is. Okay, for example, I find a position I want to zoom in and I double click right here and double click again on the point and this opens this window and I can zoom in or zoom out. For example, I zoom in right here and I'll make another point right here and double click on this point again to select it and I will zoom out at this one and now at this point it's zoomed in and then it's zooming out, zooming out, zooming out, zooming out, zooming out. Get it? That's how it works. And... Yeah, see? So, this is nothing special because I will be showing you how to make screen pumps. First, we're gonna find the bits. As you can see which song I have. Yes, with strong bits, so you can see where they are. I'll make markers at every bit by clicking M on keyboard. You don't have to do this, but I just li I like it f when doing tutorials. Oh yeah, I see them. Okay, ba I got a few bits. Now, um, uh, at the previous tutorial, I made screen pumps like this. One point directly under the bit. Four, uh, four frames before it, another point. And four frames before the next bit, another point. It should look li like this. Then you click on this one and just zoom in. A little bit, not too much like this, right? And let's see what we get. See? It looks good. Let's make that for more bits. Okay, let's say for free. And zoom all of them like this. So what do we get? Let's check it out. Yeah, this looks pretty good, right? The better way to do it. So, as I found out, you see these things right here. Linear, fast, slow, smooth, sharp, hold. Those are pretty much exactly the same features as in my uh, velocity tutorial, if you watched it. It's quite hard to explain what these do, so I can't really explain you right now. But Watch my uh, velocity tutorial when I explain what this does at velocity. And you can see at velocity, you see velocity. This is the velocity. And imagine these are screen pumps. Look, this is n normal screen pump, right? Now if I click and make slow fade, it changes. Or fast fade, it changes again. But I, I'm sorry if I confused you, because I know it's hard to understand when you begin to 
learn. So let I will just show you how to do it and you will find out later what this actually means. Right click on the uh, point right uh, under the bit and make it fast. And the uh, one before slow and the one after slow. Like this. Look now. Yes. It's going slow, 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 faster, faster and really fast. Then again fast, 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 slower, 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 slower. And m let's do this for other bits. Basically all points are um, slow. You can see yellow points are slow. These ones are fast. Um, b uh, just um, the points be under the bit are fast. And let's see what we get. Looks bad, right? Now, of course, you can experiment by putting this like this. And, for example, like this. See, it's different. A little bit better. So, yeah, basically, that's it. It's a better way to do screen pumps. I hope this video was helpful. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to ask down in the comments below. Uh, you can subscribe if you want to see more tutorials. You can also leave a like. I would really appreciate that. Thanks.